what I can do is let you know that the sartorius muscle starts right at this outer hip right here, kind of flows off the IT band, and it goes across the thigh and it wraps into the inner knee and it inserts in a really cool place, the pes anserin. That pes anserin shares two other very important connections. But for now, what I want you to focus on to loosen up the sartorius is lateral hinges and spiral lunges. Those are all available on the app. And John, I know you know this stuff pretty good. So lateral hinges and spiral lunges are gonna do two things. The first thing, it's going to loosen up that adductor line. As you're doing the lateral hinges, you're gonna to start to loosen it and kind of retension it. And then you're gonna take that same leg, granted you'll do both sides, but that same leg is gonna start rotating in pretty hard during that spiral lunge. And you're reaching, 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 sort of pulling tissue and nerve path away from the sartorius tension. That should really change how the sartorius is feeling. If it doesn't, come on in, Jake. If it doesn't feel the way that the sartorius is feeling at that moment, keep working through it and start to foam roll the adductor. Start to foam roll the gracilis muscle that also inserts into that pes anser in that place in the inner knee. Once you start to get that to coordinate, it should make a pretty big difference.